Hey Crypto Fam, thanks for joining me. And if you don't know, my name's Karen. I work in crypto and tech and blockchain, and I've developed a beginner's guide to cryptocurrency and blockchain. I'm going to be presenting this guide over the next 10 weeks. I thought we should break it up and I don't know, everyone that I have on TikTok is really serious about learning about this stuff and wants to know what's going on in the world around them and wants to learn about these things but is really overwhelmed and doesn't know where to start. And so over the last year I've been writing a book and this YouTube will be like my TikTok, uh, which is from, I guess, beginners to more tech heavy, more advanced. And then also there will be my beginner's guide, which as I mentioned, will be over the next 10 weeks. And there is also a corresponding book to go with that. I wrote a book, yeah. So I really hope you come along on this journey with me. And uh, if you've been following me on TikTok for a while, you know that I've been putting off starting this YouTube, even though there's a lot I have to share and you know, I'm, I'm loving the community, but it's hard. It's hard to get your stuff together and put yourself out there. So I do hope that you come along for the ride and support me and like and follow and subscribe wherever the buttons will be. I don't know how YouTube works. Part of this will be, <laughs> you guys will be learning crypto and blockchain. I'll be learning YouTube. Um, it'll be fun. So let's do this. Uh, let's go through who this guide is for. So this guide, this channel, while I do cater to and discuss more tech heavy topics, this beginner's guide um, playlist is for people that, as I mentioned, are keen to start investing um, and trading, but don't really know where to start and just haven't really managed to get around to it. Basically, I wrote this for me two years ago. I know a bit about the stock market, but don't know how, understand how crypto relates to it. I want to learn about crypto, but don't know where to start. I've been told it's too risky and volatile and should stick to stock markets and traditional investments. Um, by the way, even the advisors, the financial advisors these days are not really advising that. There are more and more of them are coming around to the fact that actually not having some, even if 2%, exposure to crypto is riskier than having it, but we'll get to that. Anyways, I started looking into crypto. This can be for you guys as well, but I found it all very overwhelming. Finance and numbers have never been my strong suit. I can relate to that. I am not a financial advisor. I have disclaimers everywhere that I'm not a financial advisor, and there are a ton of scammers on Instagram and on TikTok, and I post about most of them, but they are getting so ridiculously like clever these days that it's almost taking the piss. So please be careful out there, but I am not a financial advisor. I'm a teacher, I'm an educator. I have qualifications in law, information handling, privacy, tech, lots of things. So I am doing this and I will give you a link of about me and why I'm doing this and all this information somewhere because I want to give you guys the tools and the information and I don't know I I don't want people to miss out on something that big that's happening around us so I hope that you come and join me uh, I want to use my time to create my own wealth the pandemic changed many things including how I want to live my life and where I see myself. This one definitely applies to me. If you knew me pre-pandemic, no, you didn't. And I'd like to learn more about the technologies behind cryptocurrency. So if any of those things related to you, then my beginner's guide might be for you. Uh, and more on the book soon, if not already, because this will be my trailer video that will be on display at any time. So I'm just gonna run very quickly because I will put the information in a number of different places, including on my website, cryptocarin, K-A-R-I-N dot com, the 10 chapters slash 10 weeks of this course. So one, which should already be up, key concepts, uh, what is blockchain, what is crypto, what's going on here. Cryptocurrencies, uh, we're gonna talk about Bitcoin, mainly the benefits of crypto, the risks of crypto, super important one. Number three, crypto and fundamental analysis. We're gonna look at how you understand projects, how you research them, looking at the key details, 
other strategies and the bigger picture. Number four, crypto and technical analysis. What is technical analysis? What are charts? What, what are candlesticks? What's going on here? How do I read this? What tools and resources are available to me? Week five, chapter five, the world of DeFi. We're gonna talk about how DeFi works. What is decentralized finance? What is going on here? Uh, smart contracts, NFTs, stuff like that. That's gonna be a big one. Then we're gonna talk about trading and investing in crypto. Basically, how you would develop your own strategy and look at your risks and look at your approach. Like, what are the questions you're gonna be asking yourself? Again, not a financial advisor, but 15% of investors are women and that's ridiculous. And also, a lot of the male and female investors, particularly those that are investing in crypto, don't really understand these fundamentals and don't actually, you know, it, at what point is it gambling? You know, so this isn't financial advice, this is education. This is also life advice. <laughs> Trading and investing, so we're gonna talk about um, really important strategies like your stop losses and dollar cost averaging. I talk about that one a lot, stuff like that. Number seven, buying and selling crypto. That's where we're gonna get really hands on, like how to actually place trades. Uh, all the information I have is already pretty much on my various resources that I've had up for about a year, uh, if anyone's been paying attention. Love you guys. Um, but we'll get to the nitty gritty, number seven. Number eight, week eight, chapter eight, whatever, choosing a wallet. We'll talk about wallets, storing your crypto, how to do that safely. Number nine, the technology behind crypto. That's where we're gonna get a little bit more tech heavy. Uh, so within this course and elsewhere on my channel, I've there will be other things. It, it should cater to some level there should be something for everyone, is what I'm trying to say. And number 10, the finale, the future of blockchain and crypto. Where is all this going? Where could all of this go? Um, I got a comment the other day on TikTok and it was like, okay, so you changed the, so the financial system changes and then what? Well, okay, using, using the potential, the true or realizing the true potential of blockchain technology in the various sectors that it could really truly tidy up and reorganize is just a simple way to describe it. The point of that, what then, is we have better systems that are more equitable and just and enjoyable for humans everywhere, not just some of us. And for the very, very few at the top, like what then, what's it, like that's the point. So I, I am really excited because uh, blockchain is kind of a big deal, you guys, and my cat wants to be let in. And um, you probably noticed very early on in this video, I flipped from script to freeballing. Uh, again, that goes back to, we'll be figuring this out together. I don't really know what style works for me. I just know that I have some cool tools already that I wanna share with you guys and some awesome resources. And I just love my crypto community. You know who you are. And if you're not in that community, I can't wait to welcome you into my community and to the crypto community and I wish you happy and safe trading, investing and learning. I wrote that the other day. That might be my new slogan. Did we just see a catchphrase in the making? It's not that catchy. Uh, if you could kindly suggest better ones. I hope you come with me on this journey to learn cryptocurrency and blockchain over the next 10 weeks or from whenever you joined. <laughs>